The heart and the kidneys are interconnected in a very complicated way. You almost can't have one functioning without the other and vice versa. Heart failure usually can be defined as the inability of the heart to meet the demands of the body under normal pressure. Because the heart pumps blood supply to all of your organs, having a weakened heart or a heart that's not functioning under normal pressures or functioning normally can affect all of your other organs because of that heart pump. The majority of chronic kidney disease is related to high blood pressure and diabetes. This chronic kidney disease usually happens like later on in life um, and it usually happens in the setting of like uncontrolled risk factors. So for example, if your heart isn't pumping well, your kidneys may be backed up with blood or may not be getting enough blood supply. And vice versa, if the kidneys aren't working well, it sometimes causes the heart to have to work harder to pump. Healthy kidney function regulates your body fluid level. It filters out toxins and waste. It produces hormones and products that you need to make red blood cells. It also regulates your bone metabolism. So when you have poor kidney function, you may find that you have increased swelling, you feel fatigue. In the later stage of kidney disease, you might have a funny taste in your mouth because you're not removing the toxins. Our hope is to try to reduce this progression to end-stage kidney disease. There's a lot of research being done for additional medications and additional treatments to slow this progression down even further. But even if progression happens, we still have options when it comes to, to transplant. If you have high blood pressure, again, any chronic disease diagnosis is very daunting and scary, but you have to know that you have a lot of control. You can partner with your physician. There's medications that you can take to bring the blood pressure down. You can change your diet, increase your exercise, and you can really just change the trajectory. You can change and slow the progression of kidney disease. Sticking to your heart failure medications can also help your other organs, and many of the newer medications that we use for heart failure can actually also help the kidneys, for example. There is a healthcare team that is available to help you at any given time. So the doctors, the nurses, the social workers, all of us can work together to help your medications work for you.